I'm here to make an emotional video and cry on camera for five minutes. Five? Ten. Oh yeah, because I get the ad. Fifty? Come on. Fifty-five minutes. Well, how long was yours? Do One what? hour and thirty-seven how minutes. How dare you compare <laughs> me to people that make videos? Sorry. Sad. Once more feeling like, ham up there. You're sad. You're sad. You're sad. Guys, I've got some terrible news. <laughs> I can't you do it. You are the worst actor in the <laughs> I can't do it. Just come and sit down. Hi. About goddamn time. Look who it is. Why do I always have to have some convoluted entrance? I don't know. When I do a video on your channel. I was thinking we Hello. could just put a towel over you and be like, look who it is. He's still here. Not for long. Do you even know what you're saying? No. Mm. So for the first time ever in our lives, me and Dan are well, not- I mean, I mean prior to when we met. Yeah. Because you did have like a whole long life Not that we met. you knew about. I was just watching through the birth room like, I'm ready. <laughs> As I've, a five year old. I've literally been here for about 15 <laughs> seconds and you've already. Right. What do you mean you were looking through the I don't know. Room? Okay. Well, <laughs> Jesus Christ. I don't know what I'm saying. We're not going to be in the same place for a long time. How long? Gesticulation, bubble, Gesticulation. bubble, sphere, sphere, I want space, a sphere, space, space. My space. sphere goes over your This sphere. is the Venn diagram of collaboration. You went right over here, okay? Okay, fine. Since 2009, I think the longest we have ever been apart yeah. is actually two and a half weeks when you went to Florida. No, so is, that, this, is that it? This is about to be dramatic because guys, <laughs> I am about to get on a bus to go on tour to America and beep, I am beep. gone for two and a half months. That's a lot of months. It's literally not a lot of months. No. If you're, if you're talking months plural, it's two. It's two so okay. it's technically it's, the least amount of months. It's a lot of seconds. It's several seconds. Yeah. This is a truly cataclysmic moment it in is. our lives, Phil. What's going to happen? I, I, I don't know. I'm going to get a tattoo on my face. Well, I'm going to have a rejuvenation and Are you'll you come back. Are you that you're going to get Botox? No. Come no. Back and it's going to have lip fillers. I'm going to have a tattoo. I'm going to be blonde. And I'm oh gonna have God, total midlife crisis. A swag. I'm gonna have a swag about me. No, Phil, don't like do the 30 year old gay, <laughs> I'm gonna <laughs> dub blonde my hair and get tattoos I thing. said oh I wanna God. try the crisis twink life. Which explains why we are living the straight experience yeah. right now, because we are filming in front of my closet. Dan and Phil are back Look, in the closet. <laughs> we're kind of actually- We're actually, we're just in front of the in, closet. In the edge of it. Dan and Phil are just about out of the closet. Yeah, we're get, we're get, Basically, I'm get <laughs> uh, coming out. This is a bi curious location in the house. I'm feeling curious because I'm packing. I'm pa Look, there's the my breast. suitcase. I'm yeah. suit. What? I said, where's the breast? Right. Because I'm okay. bi curious. Okay. Because <laughs> Dan was packing and I brought the tripod in. I was like, we should actually commemorate this moment with a video because I might never see you again. It is like. 1 a.m. right now. Basically, every meaningful Dan and Phil video on the internet, all those fillers not on fires, were yeah. filmed at about 2 a.m. There's a certain time. <laughs> There's a certain energy where things just shift. You know when you're really tired, and then you just go all the way through to the other side, and then you just discover a whole new kind of energy. You that do. is what we are working. I'm with, feeling that sure. energy inside me right now. So packing. Not in a gay way. No, because we're we're out. The, we're half in the closet. Breast Does curious. my hair look horrible? No, it looks nice. I mean, so far I've packed some frickin' manga and a stripy shirt and some pajamas, which is yeah. all you need. Are you gonna take this? No. Why? Why would I want this the sequin like the jacket? This is the best thing you own. Hit the disco. Hit in the Toronto. disco in Toronto? I don't know. Hello? There you go. Hello? Exactly, leave me alone. That's got some blue on it. This is blue, Dan. <gasps> this is the colour blue. <laughs> what is this? It looks like a wetsuit. Oh, what yeah. What the hell is that? One day. It's quite skin tight. That is like <laughs> for a seven year old boy. Eventually it'll be a look. I thought this was like some lacy underwear then. I was like, what it's is this? It's a it? shirt, oh, no. it's Phil. A shirt. It's a lacy shirt. Get out. I feel like you wear that every single day of your life. Don't come for the stripy jumper. <laughs> That's all you wear. I like looking like a Parisian twink, thank you. Whenever I picture you in my head, you're wearing a stripy jumper. And I think it's because really? you wear it so much. Okay, well, I'm sure it smells lovely. So where are you going? What's happening? I am about who don't know. to go on a tour bus across America for ten and a half weeks. Ooh. I am going hither to thither. Thither. Wither, pliver, and quiver. If you're in quiver, it's going to be a if you're in spicy quiver, one. <laughs> I'm going to be in your hotel. <laughs> are you excited to be on a tour bus? I, I liked tour bus life. There is something about being nestled in a dark hole. Whoa. <laughs> wow. That I like. How did you fall asleep so easily? I was just like, no. If the driver breaks, all of your bones get crushed and you instantly die. Ooh. That's reassuring to me. It's just Is like, <laughs> finally I'm at peace. I think it's time for a good sleep. Delicious long sleep. Ooh. Who the hell is texting you? I've got a friend. This is the moment, right? This is the moment. 
What am I going to forget? What, what are you, what you going to forget? What am I going to forget? Hair straighteners. Hair, Dan 2013. Return him. No. It's the one <laughs> thing that I'm not going to pack. Pillow. Pillow. Oh pillow. my god, my pillow. If I don't sleep on my own pillow, I don't sleep. I took pillow I everywhere. I blood. Yeah, you can't have that. I take pillow. I take just personify That's what your I call pillow. It. <laughs> Hello, pillow. It's actually, you personify your freaking pillow and you call it pillow. It's actually an anime body pillow. That's what it is. You wish it was. It's that would make, it make sense. You're just weird. I don't want to sound like I'm just spawning Dan because it's oh. Dan. <laughs> but I went to see his tour and it is did. fucking amazing. <laughs> I'm going to bleep it. <laughs> That's how I felt. It is so good. It made wow. me want to swear. That, that you, you just shook me with that. <laughs> Did I? You really, See, you really caught me off guard. I only use them when they're important. And 13 that was it. years, you're still keeping it fresh. Mm. I'm about to leave you. I know. But just at the last second, when I think I know everything you got, you <laughs> drop an F-bomb. If you need a sign to go and get some tickets for Dan's show, this is your sign. It's that not like God is telling you no. to make a career change. No, it is. It was epic, very relatable. It might make you cry, but also it'll make you laugh. A laugh cry. Also, it was more adult than I thought it was going to be. Like you, you sometimes. It was more adult? No, like I am mouth. a 31 year old depressed homosexual that yes. is angry about the world and I've got opinions, okay? It's spicy. The year is 2022. It's spicy. Sum it up. Uh, for it people is on the fence. The Dan. Comedy show, good night out. Yeah. We're all gonna die, but maybe we can do something about it. Experience. I would say it's the best thing you've ever done. You're coming for basically I'm gay like that. Yeah. How dare you? Not the best thing you've ever done without me, obviously. Oh, I mean, yeah. no one's arrived yeah, there. No, They're better. Stan's uh, magnum opus stand up show. Yeah. Doesn't have a giant microwave. It doesn't. The merch is amazing. I went for the only one that felt fill appropriate. <laughs> Uh, it's got a nice back as well. A lot of people say they're ashamed to walk around in t-shirts with my name on it. So we've got yeah. one of those black metal band logos. And if you're not, you can just wear the Pornhub one. Honestly, I never see... <laughs> I, I look like an... <laughs> I look like an egg. Why do I look like an this egg? This is such a terrible advert for my tour merch. I promise it's cool. It makes me realise that my hair is the thing that sells my face the most. Really? If you get rid of their hair, I look so eggy. You don't want to be sat at home with FOMO and then see people in like New York or LA or Salt Lake City <laughs> having the best time ever and thinking, oh, I, I mean, I'm basically I going gone. to every single place in America. So if yeah. you are on that entire continent, yeah, I'm probably outside your house on a bus right so, now. So, go. How do they go? I should know this. Da DanielHowell.com. That's my name. That's it. Yeah, thank you for remembering, Phil. Grab well a done. tick. I was really going to be gone for like six months. No, I am home for Christmas. Good. I've got to prioritize Christmas. Oh my God. You need to see Santa. I'm going to go make out with a spider in Australia. Hot. And uh, a sheep in New Zealand. <laughs> what are you doing with the sheep? And maybe a girl in Prague. I'm not going to Prague. Hey, to several hey, other none of that. In Europe. And while Dan's doing all that, I will be here holding the fork, <laughs> making sure the house doesn't burn down. And here we are. Okay, this is the million dollar question. Phil, what are you going to do? How are you going to be? <laughs> the thing is, I've lived alone twice in my life before I knew who you were. Okay. And I kind of did all right. It took a bit of getting used to, but I think mm -hmm. you settle into that routine. You'll be completely alone. There's plenty of shit that hasn't been finished in the house True. yet. True. Sweaty builders everywhere. Ooh, that sounds nice. It's not nice. It's, it's not really nice. not nice. <laughs> Somehow they still haven't finished this house. We don't have a bath. How do we still not have I a still bath? still have a bath. It was my dream to watch Formula One qualifying in the bath on Saturday and I still can't live my dream, Phil. We do have shower, by the way. I have, I have washed. Dan does not wash his feet. Phil no. is not washed at all. The only thing I regret is all the tiles. I just see stuff in the tiles all the that's time. That's a you problem. I know, but have you seen I the- I look at it like, that's a tile. Phil's so <laughs> like, wow, I could never unsee the cowboy hat have you seen... on a dinosaur. <laughs> have you seen the cat tile over there? Do you know that gif of the cat that's like, the Twitch emotes. <laughs> yeah. Cat jam. Cat jam. The it's in the tile. Where the f is cat jam here? Yeah, imagine you don't have glasses on. If I don't have glasses on, any of this looks like anything. He's here. Look, there's his little face. Wait a minute. See? Oh my god. You see it? <laughs> no, you've just ruined the bathroom. <laughs> How could you do this to me? You'll never unsee it. I'm gonna be showering and then just being like. Yeah. yeah. So I lived alone in university in my fourth year. For a year. Ran out of okay. friends and just made some crazy YouTube videos. How long before it's just Phil is lonely, he's <laughs> licking the walls, I'm gonna, he's filming it and uh, he's I'm putting just, it on YouTube. I'm just gonna have a beard and be like, hey guys, Help me. this is my exact address. That'll be, be my friend. and you'll just go, hello Dan, how are you? Spike the cactus in your eye. Talking to my hand. Uh, and then I lived alone in Manchester. But you did not live alone in Manchester because that's when I was at university and I yes. realised very, very quick 
quickly that you had a washing machine and if I came to your house, I could just play PlayStation instead of studying for my seminars. True. That's where that scary man was like, did you... Oh, I can't say the word, but... <laughs> did you... Oh my God. That man knocked on the door and said, did you write... <laughs> on my door. No! It was like 11 p.m. at it night. So I'm just scary. sat on a beanbag trying to play Final Fantasy mooching off Phil's, you know, MBTs. Washing machine. Exactly. <laughs> and some burly drunk man knocks on the door and goes, Oi! Did you write <laughs> on my door? I, I did not. I, I was just like, Wait, excuse me. What is going on here? Yeah. Phil, He's like, did I... you go upstairs and write <laughs> some terrifying man's I door? I didn't. He was like, I know you've been complaining about me. I've had the letters. I was like, I don't know what these letters are. This guy was what like, I'm going to kill you, yeah. man with the fringe. I know. Because I think you wrote a very rude word on my door. I and mean, you were like, I don't even I know don't... who you are. I don't even know what that word means. <laughs> yeah, that's what you were like. <laughs> What, is that gonna happen here? I'm gonna come back Don't and then know. someone's gonna have killed you? Probably, I mean, I'm not gonna open the door. Ever. Ever. How are you going to drink or eat? I'm gonna farm. You're gonna catch pigeons <laughs> on the balcony. Farm the pigeons. You had so many weird I incidents don't know at why. that first apartment. You being by yourself manifests chaos. You had the yeah. holy mother when I that did. person came to the house, tried to get you to join a cult. I should have joined that cult. That man. first apartment was looking at a prison. It was. Classic. Mm. So these are the things that I'm concerned about, okay, Phil? Yeah. When I go away for 10 weeks, mm -hmm. are you going to remember to water the plants? Yeah, I'm going to water the plants. Me and the plants go way back. I was away for 10 days yeah. and when this tour started. I came back here and you forgot to water the plants. I, did, I think I, over, I, did, I, I, I meant to. I thought about doing it, but then I didn't do it. When I have the thought, I thought I'd done it. Have you ever actually kept a plant alive? I have. I did that whole spawn about keeping plants alive. And I learned the facts. I, I did! Pop quiz. What? Yeah. No, oh god. What is the thing with this plant, Phil? Don't lick it. Don't rub it on a cat or a baby. <laughs> Poisonous. Yeah. Naughty. This plant has gone absolutely crazy. I feel like I should stop watering that so it can calm down a bit. It's about to go inside my nostril. What's the deal with this little guy? It looks like a butt. It looks like a heart. Butt heart. And... <laughs> what? Water it once a week. Once a month, otherwise it dies. No. What's it called? Peace Lil. Peace Phil. Lily, Philly, please. Uh, stick your finger in and see if it's dry. Oh my god, Phil, what is I, going I on? I don't know, I thought there Phil. was a cacti. Cacti don't need water. That's a cactus, that was a plant. It's like a meerkat dying from green. Oh god. What is the liquid level in all of these going to be when I get back? Look at the abundance, I Phil. Don't do anything with this. Abundant Phil. Walking down the stairs. <laughs> that's something that you don't know how to do. And all the time, Dan is like, Phil, you're going to die if you walk down you the have, stairs like that. You've never experienced terror until you've seen this man running, <laughs> skipping every other step. All right, Phil. This might be a bit for a video. Also might be the last moment of your life. This is how I walk down the stairs. I don't think it's that bad. This is like a normal speed. You are in socks and we have a floating staircase. Look, I've got places to be. Where do you have to be, Phil? With my people. I feel very attacked right now. Turn the PS4 off. It's happy. That's what you don't know how to do. It's just buzzing it's away. It's not happy. It's like, I like, it's like a alive. dog in a hot car. <laughs> what do you do if there's a fire? Uh, huh? Scream. No. Run around like The Sims. I set myself yeah. off. Yeah, you'll just go. Ooh, 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 ooh. All right, Phil. How do you turn off a PlayStation 4? <laughs> Why are the buttons so small? They are actually stupid. No, it's not that. Where is it? That was eject. Oh no. You lose. <laughs> is it? Is it? Oh no. Oh god. Oh god. It's explode. Oh Bill. god. Ten. No. no. Okay, just fire extinguisher now. Go, go. Pull out the pin. Pull out the pin. Please. Please. Recycle. Recycle. I do recycle. I'm good at recycling. No. I will come back and you will have turned this room into a mountain of cardboard boxes, which you do not want to take out because you don't want to bump into a neighbor. You know I attract weirdness. You go in the recycling room, there's no one there. I go in, there's a woman giving birth and I've got to help <laughs> pull the placenta out. That's what happens to I me. don't care, you still have to do it. Fine, I'll do it. What else is there? What else could there possibly be? Where is your finger going? Yes. Do you gold pig anything while I'm gone? I'll gold everything. I'll put on the floor. There's gonna be nine piglets waiting for you. Don't even joke about that, I'm not gonna come back. You're the one that hasn't lived alone. I don't know why you're coming for me so hard. Because Nate. I know you. Because Nate. I know what you're like all the time. And this is like. what's gonna happen. I don't think you're gonna survive being on tour. Like, you're gonna forget all of those things. That you can't oh, do. Yeah, those things. Yeah. Like what? We What's gonna happen without me? We left Dan alone for two minutes in America. He was being questioned by the police. <laughs> do you remember that? <laughs> 
That was a misunderstanding. Oh, a misunderstanding. They started shouting at you. I was taking selfies in an airport toilet. Don't do that. Because the lighting was lit. Yeah. And then a cleaner came in and thought that I was trying to film people sh- No. And I was not. <laughs> and I had to stand there while a park ranger <laughs> went through my that. camera roll. Yeah. And they were just flicking through hundreds. There were so many. Hundreds. Of cringe selfies that I took in this toilet. You know, I blame America for that. Why are the stalls so open? Why do you want to look at each other on the toilet? It's like you can walk past and you flash for a second, you make eye contact with someone fully dumping a load in the toilet. Look straight in. No, thank you. Weird. I mean, they almost took his passports. I was almost UK tour. That is a Dan moment. That was very Dan. What else is Dan going to flop at? Where are you not going to shower? Where am I not going to shower? You failed, you died. What? In the tour bus. You can't shower in the tour bus. Oh, you and the frickin' amoebas. The amoebas. They will go into your brain. The iconic hypochondriac is like, if you go in a shower anywhere that has a tank of water, it is infested with brain-eating parasites that will instantly kill you. If the water gets hot enough and it's just sat there under the bus. You've seen how gross these backstages and theatres are. Yeah, I know, but you've got to go in the bus. No, don't shower in the bus. Also, don't poop on the bus. You do have to remember that. You can do number ones, it can't do number twos. No, and it's if so you do awkward. That, that is... If it's four in the morning and you're like, can we stop at a service station? It's so, like, mortifying. <laughs> it's really horrible. It's a different lifestyle. Yeah. No one is going to hear... Right, Dan has this tone, right? Whenever oh. he speaks in a oh public setting... Oh my God, Phil, for some reason, not, don't come for me like this. For some reason, the volume or the, the wavelength of Dan's voice... I everyone actually have a problem that I was given at birth and you shouldn't make fun of it, okay? Yeah. I My voice just happens to be a tone in everyday conversation <laughs> where it, you just can't hear it. You can't it hear it. Into a so room. Dan will say a whole thing and no one will look at him and, and, and then I've got to say, Dan, you're doing the you're I doing will the tone. be sat at a dinner table in a circle with six people and I'll go, and yeah, that's what I thought when I went there last week. What do you think, Phil? And then everyone in the table will just be looking down at their not, bread. They're not hearing and it. And they'll just, they'll just start talking over me and I will be like, am I a f- Dirt. Imagine like an ambient room right now. Let's do some like. Oh, wait, wait, here comes Danny starting to talk. Phil actually has to make a point out of saving me and I getting do. me to repeat what happened. I go, what did you just say, Dan? But, oh, Dan! I think Dan just had something to say. Everybody, look at Dan. And I'll be like, but, but, I, I, I was just, I, I was just, just saying say a uh, funny thing about opinion. Am I right? I feel like. I need a moment away from you yeah. so I can learn to just be a normal person. You're going to learn it's worse. Also, I feel like we enable all the good stuff as well, like creativity, bouncing around ideas. Eating pizza three nights a week that's, and playing Mario Kart that's also instead of filming content. We're filming this now. We should probably finish packing. Yeah, no, this is literally the last thing I should be doing. You are leaving me. This literally isn't clickbait. It, it wasn't, no. It's off. But also, after... Dan and Phil finally tell the truth. We're in a post clickbait world. It is weird that you're back on YouTube. It's though. Like, weird. Who, who oh, is thank that? you. Yeah, right. I, I really have been pouring my heart and soul into this dystopia daily thing. Phil's yeah. review, weird. Dan's really made a whole show. I was just thinking, like, what is this? post burnout meta content I can make. Yeah. I just want to do something that makes me laugh. I know. I'm, I'm, I'm having fun. So yeah, subscribe to this new YouTuber oh, if you've not yeah. heard of him. Yeah. Do not give yourself FOMO. If it's the last thing you do... Which it might be because the world's ending. Go see Dan on tour, danielhowell.com. I might come again. You might see me in the Hashtag audience. Hashtag ad. Yeah. You might. Well, you said that you were going to invite yourself to Australia and yes. some of the Europe shows because you just want a free holiday. I, I like That's not holiday. how that works. No, I'm going to be touring America to do a show mm. and then Europe and Australia. Australia. You can't just be like, hello, I'm here for a holiday. Oh Thank God, you. Holiday. Okay. Are we going to survive this? I don't know. Let's find out. Stay this tuned. This is the ultimate YouTube experiment. You're about to see a spectacular meltdown in two completely opposite directions. If you're excited for that meltdown, give us a thumbs up. <laughs> <laughs> Subscribe to me. Subscribe to this guy. What a brave new world. See him on the tour. internet for so long. This is a first. Ding our bell. My bell. Both bells. Ding both of our bell. <laughs> <laughs> Tickle those bells. Uh, have a good life. Hope you're doing well. And I'll see you when I'm alone. Goodbye. Get out. Bye.